be alert to a family member. Like we're finding out, for example, that a lot of men, more men than we thought, have eating disorders. It's about 9 to 10. They have to be very vigilant. When they see changes happening to their adolescent child, they need to not write it off to, well, this is just a phase they're going through. Seek out medical advice quickly. And if it's not working, push, push, shove, and be strong in that area. Because from that point on, things get better. When you admit that you have an eating disorder and you're getting medical treatment for it, things have to get better. So we have to, I think, discuss amongst ourselves in a family that there's an eating disorder that exists. There's nothing to be ashamed of. Mm -hmm. Eating disorder is like any other kind of a problem. Once we're open about it, and once you and I are talking about it, and a mother and a child are talking about it, things get better than, than ignoring it because I can assure families who are listening today that once this disease matures, it is a very serious disease and becomes very difficult to, to cure uh, for the longer term.